Ever wonder how to customize the four top buttons on the welcome to into this tablet? So watch the video to learn how. This is us. Better videos. Better learning. So hello everyone, what to consider the lesson set going to show a way to actually uh, customize the top button of the welcome tablet. So the things you need is the drivers. Uh, so you can get the drivers from the website, especially that's in the user manual, you can have it, or you can use the DVD. By default, the drivers will automatically be installed in your computer if you have Windows 7 or later. But eventually, if you don't, eventually uh, you will follow the steps. First, go to the website that's uh, on the bottom. Which, uh, I will not tell you, but it's welcome.com for the tools for the four star welcome. Then, we should go to the next link that comes up and uh, every two down the drivers. It will also say we should get the support drivers if you don't want to go to the second link. So, Eventually, then go to go to search for Wacom. Uh, then you will click the Wacom tab of properties for pop, pop up. Eventually, you can, there you can uh, eventually do a lot of things. Eventually, you can uh, customize the, the those top buttons. The main reason that I made this video. So you can actually um, the first button will customize the Windows key. I go. I mean the uh, actually the bottom right button is actually the by default is the Windows key. But you can customize it and make it into uh, eventually a, a, a well, launch a program. So I'm going to make this launch interact folder. So I will go to my program files times 86 with a 64 bit computer. You should watch my video uh, to uh, actually see if your computer is a 64 bit or 32 bit to see that and i'm going to use inter explorer for this example um it's it's, it's ix4.exe the executable and then press ok and virtually you're going to just uh, press that button and it will start inter explorer how, how cool is that it's like a macro key settings like an expressive mice so the, the next thing is you can even press the default button if you customize too much and want to do your original default. So virtually by default, the, the virtually you can see with, by default the, the default buttons. But eventually that's all. Um, you can actually uh, the Windows key virtually uh, that isn't working very well right now. Um, it's actually actually uh, it will start. The the uh, start button, virtually, but uh, virtually, if you have Windows, still using a Windows a, a computer, it would actually start that whole gigantic start menu. So this is just that lesson. Subscribe to my channel, like the video, and share the video uh, with other friends and interest. So watch my last video. So to that video, my Christian So thank you for watching the video. Bye.